Problems with your Dell laptop Inspiron 1500 series shutting off in the middle of doing something important? Well, we'll show you how to open this thing up and what's causing this. First, flip it over and you'll see a whole bunch of screws on this little plastic cover here. Undo these screws and then put your finger under here and it'll kind of snap off. Remove that and you're going to get to the heat sink area. Here you're going to see five screws here. One, two, three, four, and there's one under this little tab, five. Undo these five screws. And be careful, if you just turn it off, this thing will be like screeching, blazing hot. So I lift it up by uh, one of these guys. And it should come out. Oh, look at that. Not only is this thing gnarly, but check this out. Ew, now that's just gnarly. Looks like they've got a cat or something, all kinds of fur and dander in there. So if your processor can't get adequate ventilation, it's got circuitry in it that will shut itself off. It doesn't want to burn up, it doesn't want to start a fire, it doesn't want to emit toxic fumes in your house. So if it's too hot, a little temperature gauge on side your motherboard will shut it down to avoid any potential fire. And, and if you've got all kinds of junk in your trunk, of course it's going to shut down. It's going to get hot. This thing can't breathe. So you take this nasty stuff out. Ew. And I'm going to take a can of compressed air and uh, blow this out real well. I'm also going to blow this guy out too. And uh, we should have resolved our Dell Inspiron overheating problem. Fortunately, this is one of the easier ones to open. Some of them you got to pull the entire back case apart. It's like 70 screws in some of them. It's ridiculous. But this Dell Inspiron 1500 series is real easy to do. Just a couple of screws, and uh, you're off to the races. You might want to put a little more thermal paste on here, too, just to make sure. It look like there's a whole bunch on there, so I'll put a little dab on top of that, too. You can get that for 5 bucks at any computer store. Chuck Fresh to PCGYN. It's Computer Care Clinic's tip of the day.